I'm Audrey Hale and I built Satellite. I did not expect to be asked to go to Maker Fair for my school science project, but it, it didn't end there. I was picked to go to the White House. Um, pretty much how I had made my satellite was, first of all, I got all the components. There's a really, really important thing, how I made it. <laughs> well, of course I had to solder all the components onto the pickaxe board, and an uh, important part of it was I had to program it. So, programming it, it was easy at first, but then I kind of got a little stuck. But yeah. when I launched at National Maker Fair, it had, I think it went up about 440 feet. Couldn't really get into the air. Okay. I'm so windy. Oh. And something you should know if you're going to launch a satellite, the first time I launched it, I, I had launched it in a national park, but it didn't really work out because there were <laughs> trees that nearly popped the balloons. It was not very good, but that was, it worked out and the balloon thing didn't work. I mean, the balloon thing did work. It didn't pop. Yeah. Okay. Did you get good pictures from it? Yes, I got two really good aerial photos. They were a bit blurry, but it was pretty high in the air and you were able to see everything on there. Of course, I had, I had to explain to everybody what there were, but see, it wasn't that blurry. For me, I like it because so many times we hear that girls don't advance in math and science. So Audrey is definitely an example. She sets the bar. And then her project is out of the ordinary. We really don't have children building satellites in the fifth grade. And then to be asked to go to Washington and present, that just really makes her stand out. And it's what we look for in students, to go above and beyond, the same that we would expect with teachers. So I'd yeah. like to thank my teacher, Miss McKee, my reading teacher, Dr. Rhodes, and my principal, Dr. Nelson. And my mom. <laughs> <laughs>